He'd rather be throwing back a beer than a football. Football, Max. Big football. Step away. There's Kate, looking sadder than usual. Hi, Kate. Hey, Max. Awesome. You look down. You okay? I'm kind of over humanity today. Sorry to be a drama queen. Is there anything... Max, I'd like to be alone, if you don't mind. I'm sorry. Max, get a clue. <laughs> Howdy, Samuel. Well, hello there. What's up with these Rachel Amber posters? Well, only she would know that, right? Uh, I guess. Nice, it just makes the campus look sad. You can't color over that sunlight. You knew Rachel? How can you know a prison? You just stare in awe. Now I have to go paint windows. Dude. What do you think happened to her? Best not to dwell on the past. Samuel looks forward, awesome. like a clock. What was she like? She must have been popular. Even sunlight can cast shadows. Rachel did both at once, you know. Nice. She was like a battery, positive and negative. See you later, Samuel. And watch your step around here, Max. Sweet. After I sweep, I paint. It's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. Yeah. The Daguerrean processor. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> Since no. you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh, wait. Hold that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh, yes, Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. That's the first and last time I expect to hear that. Do you want... Get lost. Okay, now where exactly is the sprinkler valve? I could crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her clones incentive to beat it. No. This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to use. This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to use. I need to figure this out.
There goes Samuel da Vinci to paint the window. What the hell? Are you kidding? Look at this! Jill, Victoria, it's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. <sighs> I had the mic off there for about five minutes, but it's basically just me mumbling to myself. <laughs> I can't grab that. Samuel is way too close. Jill, Victoria, it's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. I can't grab that. Samuel is way too close. I get it, wait, what? I need to... Ah, uh, I have an idea. Let's try something different. There we go, tamper with this, and then we go to the sprinkler. Okay, let's see if this works. This on, and then I can't skip the cutscenes. My right bumper doesn't work. Are you kidding? Look at this. Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. Alright, that looks like I did it. I think it's a bit too overboard, though, but. Wet paint is not good for hair, nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. Huh? Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? I am sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. It was. But there'll be another. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. He's one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. To be honest, it still looks like someone just busted a load all over your back, though, so I'm not trying you to be that nice. A shot. Sorry about blocking you and and the go fuck your selfie. That was mean, but pretty funny. Just one of those days, you know? I know exactly what you mean, Victoria. I'll see you later. Au revoir. Should have made fun of her, but Victoria probably played me. Not, not right now. Room two seventeen. No way in hell am I ever going in here. What's in two seventeen? Victoria is going to be pissed. We took so long. Welcome to Black Hill. Welcome to Black Hill. So I'm at 219. Who's Stella Hill and why is she in 217? So I'm at, I'm at 219. 
Blackwell isn't that big, but it sure feels like a labyrinth. I'm just wondering what happens if I go outside. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was going to see what happens if I go outside and they're all like, mopping her up. <sighs> Taylor is a slave. Is this a Vortex Club or a Victoria Club initiation? Truly pathetic. Red Rum. Someone's a fan of their Stephen King. Juliet, extreme reporter. <coughs> this girl must have been popular. She's everywhere. Nice atmospheric shot. Needs dusting. At least that's an alarm from this century. They live. Okay, this is just mean and stupid. We'll bang for Jesus. I don't get it. This is like the public DNA of our dorm. I bet those are real numbers and um, uh, websites in America or North America, even. Oh, Victoria, give me a fucking break. So there's someone in there curled up on their bed. Oh, maybe not. Maybe just sofa cushions. But what's this poster really trying to tell me? 3.14 pi. Pi, pi. Warren oh. should be all over Brooke. They're perfect for each other. Yeah, 3.1419 or something is pi, isn't it? And why is their pi... Uh, I don't know. I didn't get it. <laughs> That's my room. How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. I wonder if it's like the whiteboard in Duke Nukem just draw like a giant dick. <laughs> Obvious, but true. Oh. Be a bit more upbeat. We get it. She's missing. Somebody has gone crazy. Could be fun. Glad I'm not the only lonely nerd around here. Hmm. Nothing interesting happening in there. Cool, I guess I'll head into uh, Max's dormitory. Missing an eye. I think everyone's home dorm home. room has a guitar. My favorite cocoon. Would Man Ray call them selfie portraits? It's not exactly pretty in pink, but no shits are given. I like. I can't seem to find the how to call them. Oh, cookies, clothes. It's not exactly pretty in pink, but no. I love that mom sent me a fat box of chocolate coconut bites for my birthday. And slipped in a $200 gift certificate. She sure knows how to make a sad. It's such a pretty guitar. I need to play it more. Hard to believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. It's nice.
That was nice. I'll miss going to the games with my dad. Go Thunderbird. <coughs> I'm glad Kate let me borrow her copy of the Oct 